hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel today i'll be showing you 10 tips that you can use to improve the performance of your laptop or your computer and uh, if this is your first day to watch my youtube channel please make sure you subscribe like and share this video and i'll be so much thankful i'll be going straight forward to the ways that you can improve the performance of your laptop or your computer the first tip is uh, close down the startup programs that you don't really need for you to do this come down here where we have our taskbar then uh, where we have our taskbar then right, uh, right click then click tax uh, task manager select task manager <coughs> after selecting task manager you will be required to come here startup so startup these are programs that start each and every time that you start your machine and they usually consume a lot of uh, a lot of uh, space in your machine and this uh, reduces the performance of your machine so to make sure that uh, this does not happen so come here uh, for me i don't have so many programs but for you from your side you may be having several programs that are running so for you to do to disable this you will first of all require to select for example the first one which uh, says screen record i don't need this one then you come down here then you click disable then we have also vlc i don't need that one to start each and every moment then you click disable then you go uh, disabling each and every program that you don't require to start during the startup of your machine uh, also you can disable all of them but i prefer when it comes to windows security info, uh, notification icon please do not disable this one because it will be giving you notifications of any virus that is identified in your machine second tip is to make sure that your machine is, a, is at a position of deleting the files that are not necessary especially the temporary files for you to do this uh, come here to the start key then click settings after clicking settings come here to the system the first option system then after clicking that come down here where we have storage then after coming here to storage you have the first option where it says storage sense can automatically free up space by getting rid of the files you don't need like temporary files and content in your recycle bin then make sure you turn that on this one will be able to delete files that you don't really need and the temporary files that are created by the machine that tip on how to perform to increase the performance of your machine is to update your computer so most of the time the machines can run slowly because they are using a very old version of the uh, of the operating system that is currently in use so for you to update your computer first of all come to the start key then click settings then after clicking settings then you'll be able to have a window like this one if you have this one then come here down here where we have update and security click update and security then from this point you can be able to download for here i will uh, click download for example if there is any update that i that is there i will be able to download it and it will be installed into my machine and this also helps in improving the performance of your laptop or your machine so make sure you update your machine the fourth tip on how to improve the performance of your laptop or your machine <coughs> is to clean your c drive and for you to do that come here to the start key type disk cleanup press enter then you'll have a small window like this one so make sure if you have this window come here select drive c then select ok after selecting ok you'll have another video like this one which will be showing you the amount of uh, the amount of files uh, the amount of gb of mbs or uh, the data that is stored there temporarily you can check all of these ones if you don't need them but for me i will not check 
the one that is saying die loans because I need my die loans. I don't want to empty them. Then click OK. Then it will ask you, are you sure you want to permanently delete these files? Select delete these files. Then it will take some few seconds before it completes. Then the fifth tip on how to make sure that your laptop or your machine is running very fast or it is uh, performing very well is to make sure you manage your desktop. You will find some people that the desktop is full of files uh, and the folders that are not necessary. If possible, you can collect, you can take all those folders uh, and store them into another drive. For example, I have this one, Opera, and I have another one, which is a new folder. I'll just pick this one, I'll select both of them, then I'll cut them, then I'll come to my new drive, which is drive D, and then paste them there. This makes sure, this makes, uh, this ensures that your desk top does not affect the performance of your machine so please make sure that you manage your your desktop you don't have so many files especially folders that are very large like movies and other folders tip number six is make sure that you restart your machine regularly this is especially for people who use their machines and they don't turn them off for example you'll find a computer is always on 24 7 or it is always on 24 hours so make sure that you restart your machine each and every day especially when you use your machine for long hours for you to do this you just come to the start key then you click the power button then you click restart this will help to close down the programs and also to give the the machine enough time to reconfigure again the next tip is to check for viruses or spamware spyware so for you to check for, uh, to check for spyware or, or viruses come to the start key again click then click setting after clicking settings this window will pop up come here where we have updates and the security click updates and the security then come where we have select window security Then when you click Windows Security, then make sure that you select the first one in protection area, select virus protection. Then you can here scan for virus and also check and make sure that your machine is working very well. Tip number eight is to make sure that you empty your recycle bin regularly. This is because all the files that you delete from your computer are not permanently deleted. So for you to delete them permanently or to remove them from your computer and to ensure that the performance of your machine is good, make sure that you empty your recycle bin. For you to do this, come on your desktop and find where you have your recycle bin. Then select and open your recycle bin. From here, you will find all the files that you have deleted, either movies or any file. Select or empty recycle bin. After clicking this empty recycle bin, you'll be required to confirm. Say yes. The next thing is to make sure that you delete the files that are created temporarily in your machine. For you to access these temporary files, press Windows key plus R. Then type temp. Then press enter. After pressing enter, you'll be taken to this window. Sometimes it will be, it will may ask you for access. Then you just click access, then select all, then delete them. After clicking delete, this type of window will pop up. Just click continue. Then you can just for the ones that are not be, uh, that cannot be able to be deleted, you can click skip. Also, there are other files that are also hidden and you require to delete them. These are also temporary files that are created by the, by the apps or programs that are running. Also, for you to do that, press Windows key plus R. Then type percentage temp 
percentage then press enter then you'll be taken to such a window then select all and click delete then it will it will then it will ask you if you are sure you want to delay then click yes then you can skip the ones that are not possible to be deleted The last tip or an additional tip on how to make sure that your machine performs very fast or it has a good performance, make sure that you are not running several uh, up programs or apps at the same time. For example, if you are not using an app, it is good to close it and then proceed with whatever you are doing. Thank you so much guys for watching my videos. Please, if you have not subscribed, make sure that you subscribe and hit the, uh, the notification bell to make sure that you receive a notification each and every time that I upload a new video. Thank you so much. Please don't forget to subscribe.